Well, the next three years will be a crucial transition period for the construction sector, says Senior Minister of State for National Development, Li Yishen. While speaking in Parliament today, Mr Li stressed that firms will have to adapt to the tightened labour supply situation. And this means seizing all opportunities to mechanise, automate and streamline workflow for higher productivity. Olivia Xiong reports. A record number of build-to-order flats to build, accelerated construction of MRT lines. These are some of the key public projects that will be taking place in the next few years. But how will this pan out when the quota of foreign construction workers allocated to a contractor is cut by another 15% in July? The government is raising the bar. The minimum buildability and constructability score that has to be met will be raised progressively from July this year. This means architects and engineers will have to deliver easier to construct designs and technologies. While at the construction stage, contractors will have to use more manpower-saving construction methods. The tender process for the public sector will be tweaked. From July this year, consultants and contractors with high buildability and constructability scores, records respectively, can score higher in the quality component of their tender bids, giving them an edge over other bids. Under our tender evaluation framework, it does not necessarily mean that bids with the lowest price will always win the tender. To defray the cost involved, the government will enhance its $250 million construction productivity and capability fund. This includes increasing the co-funding from 50 to 70 percent for the leasing of equipment and the re-engineering of work processes. That is if a 30% improvement in productivity is achieved. And the Building and Construction Authority says all this could spell good news for Singaporeans. We should see a cleaner construction site. Less dusty, less noisy, less impact on residents living around the site. The second thing we should see with more prefabrication, precast off-site, you can do better coordination so you can shorten your construction time. I think all these are important to the construction industry. Mr Lee added BCA will continue to help the industry look for other new resources to support the restructuring of the industry.